All right, welcome back to Better Kansas City. Time to get in a workout, so get stretched out and everything. Oh, wait, this one is for <laughs> your brain. We have world champion boxer and health professional Samaya Anani from Learning to Fly here to help us keep our mind in tip-top shape. You brought along a lot of books uh, here, but uh, there's one author in particular you were just talking to me about uh, that really has helped you kind of uh, get mind fit, so to speak? Yes, Dr. Daniel Amen was in this Regain Your Brain Summit that I listened to, and he's the mm -hmm. leading expert in brain. He's scanned over 100,000 brains, and for the Alzheimer's prevention, dementia, Parkinson's, these kinds of things. So it really is important, he says, in your 20s and 30s to start taking care of your brain. Okay. You know, three million people a year are coming down with Alzheimer's, and as we get more baby boomers going into the yeah. older, we need to really be mindful of this. So we came up with this really easy acronym, okay. Bright Mind which Bright helps minds. you think of the different 11 risk factors and how to take care of your brain. Mm -hmm. And so the first one is blood flow and high interval intensity burst training like boxing since you seem to want to be going at it this morning. <laughs> I was watching you. <laughs> well, I was a little fired up when, with were. the old destruction <laughs> demo part, but yeah, um, maybe a little. So that's, that's like your exercise. That's Number your, one. It's immediate really effects fit. to the brain blood okay. flow get the blood moving exercise retirement and aging don't stop learning keep mm -hmm. learning new things you might be great at playing the guitar and, and doing crosswords do something new keep learning keep challenging your brain okay eye is inflammation you know sugar is one of the leading causes of inflammation of the body mm. you saw my sugar display here many yeah. months ago get rid get rid of highly refined highly processed Sugar. Sugar, like your like, soda pops and stuff like that, right? Yeah, okay. and omega threes are really good for helping keep the inflammation down. Good mm -hmm. foods for the brain. You were asking about that blueberries, walnuts, avocados, oh, those yeah. healthy fats. Is that kind of like I've heard about the Mediterranean diet before where they really emphasize a lot of the, the healthy fats, you know, with like coconut oils with those nuts and, and kind of is that kind of the same? Yes, yes. Okay. Get, get those oils because your, your brain's 60% fat. Yeah. Three pounds, 60% fat. It's pretty amazing. <laughs> All right, let's move on to what we got. Yeah. I think we're in genetics, right? Genetics. If you have history of Alzheimer's or Parkinson's mm -hmm. or dementia in your family, you're even more prone, so you really need to be mindful of the rest of these. Okay. H is head trauma. Uh -oh. You know, head trauma is the leading cause of depression and homelessness. I really? didn't know that. Yeah. Huh. So if you've played football, if you had a bike wreck, I was a professional boxer. I'm more, you know, i got to watch that. <laughs> yeah. I'm, I'm I, got, I only got hit four times. Okay. <laughs> yeah. He talks about the head trauma from hitting a soccer ball. Your brain mm -hmm. is the consistency of butter. Oh, my so goodness. So hitting, hitting the soccer ball with your head is really not a good idea. Uh oh Well, that's why they've outlawed it. In a hand, in my son's league, I mean, exactly. you, can't, you can't do a header anymore. Exactly. So. All right, toxins. Toxins. We know so many things we put on our body are mm -hmm. have toxins. Lead, 60% of women's lipstick has lead. Really? The main things to look at is hairspray and sunscreen. Those are the really big ones. Hmm. But, for, you know, firefighters, he did a study with firefighters, you know, carbon monoxide, mold in the house. Yeah. Those are toxins you're breathing in. And I know a lot of the, the firefighters brain. also have to deal with after they go fight the fires, they come take their, their uniforms off and it still has a lot of that stuff that's caked on it, you mm -hmm. know? So, but yeah, exactly. Exactly. So let's run through the rest of the Right. Mental Minds, mental health. Are mm -hmm. you doing something for stress and anxiety? Kill the ants, he says. Automatic negative thoughts. Meditation is a important. I is two things, immunity and infection. So really boosting your immune system is really important to keeping the brain healthy. Mm -hmm. Obviously, the neuro N is neurohormonal. Get hmm. your hormone panel. So DHEA, know where you're at, especially when you get to be 40. Is that a normal estrogen. blood work that your doctor can do and you have to ask for it? You have to ask for it and you most likely have to pay for it. This, oh. this is not usually covered in insurance, which I think it really should be because mm -hmm. this is one of the best things you could look at as you get older. All right, you know. finally, dia the diabetes. Diabetity, the bigger you are, actually the smaller your brain is. Mm. So the more weight you have put on, you've got to really think about getting it, and then sleep. Okay. Getting seven hours of sleep. Your brain needs seven hours. Oh, seven hours of sleep. I wish we could get there. That's, that's the goal. <laughs> so Maya, we do appreciate <laughs> you being here. And the author's name again, Dr. Uh, Amen, is what you can look for. Thank you very much.